everybody, Laura Muse here. So, um, didn't do any videos last week, but I'm back on it this week. And today is my third video of Laura on location in Sheffield. So, if you can't quite remember what I'm doing, I'm going to five different locations within Sheffield and um, with five big reasons why Sheffield's a great place to invest. Um, and then also be doing um, the strategies that go with that um, in regards to the areas. So today um, I am in um, an amazing place which over the last 10 years has got some massive, massive growth. Um, it's actually been voted one of the um, best mini epicentres, um, if that's what the word is, in, uh, in the country. So it's a really vibrant place, um, it's really attracting um, students and young professionals. It's a real hip and trendy place, it's got wine bars, food places, a lot of new businesses come here. Um, so a lot of unique um, non-chain businesses are in, in this area. Um, so I'll uh, show you which area it is. Um, so today, I, it's a bit backwards obviously, um, it's in Kellam Island in Sheffield. Um, I absolutely love this area. Um, so behind me here, um, you can see lots of new apartments. Um, there's planning permission gone in for a lot more. Um, so just down the road, um, you can see a crane, crane behind me in that direction. Um, so just down the road, they're building another 120 apartments there, which is going to be a mix of um, student and young professionals. So what's working in this area? I'm sure you know exactly what I want to say to you. Um, so I've got quite a lot of people who um, I'm friends with, very good friends with, who heavily invest in serviced accommodation in this in this particular area. It's it's literally a short walk to the city centre of Sheffield. You can get on a tram. Um, not far from the hospitals, it's got great access to the, um, the motorway links, not far away. Um, it's just a really a, amazing place um, to, to live. Um, and like I say, there's so many new um, independent businesses. Um, and two massive things that happened here um, is a couple of months ago we got um, the cutlery works, which um, this area predominantly was um, Sheffield Steel. Obviously when all that ended, you can see behind me, that's Kellam Island Museum. Um, when obviously that went to China, this, this area was basically derelict. Um, so the cutlery works, that has been um, transformed into, it's a big warehouse. Um, inside there is all sorts of different food and wine from all over the world. Um, and it's great for startup business as well because you know, can actually just be there for six weeks, six months, and you're getting a lot of new um, businesses coming into that area. Um, and it's a great, great afternoon out, if I'm honest. Um, another big thing that happens here is Peddler Market. Now, um, Peddler Market is once a month, so it's the first weekend of every month, and it's just amazing. There's people that come with um, food, drink from all over the country, really independent. Uh, one man bands um, but the food is amazing so you get like a mini that's converted into a barbecue um, so yeah if you love food and wine Kellam Island in, in Sheffield is definitely the place to be plus it's got a massive great opportunity for service to accommodation um, we've also got the opportunity ourselves to be taking on some SA units um, so I'll keep you posted if if that potentially does come off, fingers crossed it does. Um, but yeah, so Kellam Island in Sheffield has grown massively over the last 10 years. Um, prices are obviously going up, um, but service accommodation, it, it's so hot here. Um, so if you can invest in Kellam Island for service accommodation, I would 100% recommend you do it. And there's so many companies now that are coming into Sheffield that manage your service accommodation units for you. And I can highly recommend a couple as well. But yeah, hope that's helpful. Um, Laura and Location is back. And um, I'll see you for the next instalment, which will be tomorrow. Cheers.